Oh, that's alright. Hey, hello guys. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Blair. If you're new here, hello. I'm in school to become a dietitian. It's my boyfriend, Matthew. Oh, that's lovely. In our last video, the taste test, the Trader Joe's new winter products taste test. You guys are seeming to love that video. I mentioned that we are going to be making like Shake Shack burgers tonight with one of our friends coming over. So we're making burgers for all of us and you guys wanted to see the recipe. So we are gonna share that with you guys today. What else do we have to add? Oh, I'm drinking uh, Trader Joe's white wine. I forgot what it's called. I'll show you. You tell me what you're drinking, Matt. I'm drinking an H-E-B brown. Uh, for Buck. This is the one I'm drinking. It's one of my favorite whites from Trader Joe's. This is a cute little glass I got from Hobby Lobby. And this is ketchup. Okay, Jake Shack sauce is like the best part of the for whole burger and the process of how you cook the patties. Those two things are very important and specific to Shake Shack. So if you want to see how we make our Shake Shack remake burger, then just keep on watching. So cheers! Oh. I also want to show the immaculate vibes right now in our apartment. Oof! Oof, I got the... Netflix Birchwood fireplace on. Do the Birchwood, it's better than the traditional. This was our, our Cyber Monday purchase. We got a new desk, double monitors, keyboard, everything. We got Alexa back there. Lighten it up. All right, Matt. Okay. Show us what you got. Or the Shake Shack, Shake Shack sauce. Oof. In order of quantities. Mayonnaise. You're supposed to use Dijon, but Dijon or spicy mustard. Cat soup, pickled juice, just a little splash. It's a little wild card. And then a little dash of cayenne. All gone, Herm's got his. Okay, so let's see how you do it. Oh yeah, we're using up the rest of. Herman. Herman, is that your bone? Where's your bone? Herman. <laughs> oh, you. Oh, athlete. Okay, intermission. Usually I get this off Thrive Market. You can, yeah, you can get it in store too, but we get it off Thrive Market. So, again, we're making a lot of sauce. The sauce stays really well. You can also dip the fries in it too. You make a little animal style fry. And that overhead shot. On a guard. All right, and then you have, there you have it. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna taste it and kind of see. Where we're at, big boy. Do you swear you like these potato rolls a lot? You like potato rolls? I potato rolls. Oh, is that very specific to Shake Shack? Potato rolls, and the consensus is that Martin potato rolls are the best. Oh. I don't know if that's a Texas thing or. I don't know. I've never. I don't know. All right. Apparently, those are the best. Well, this is the longest compilation of you just. Mixing a I'm sorry, I'd like to do this properly. Okay, so now we've got a nice homogenous mixture. All right, bio. We're gonna pop that in the fridge. If you're curious, I just got this Amazon flannel in the mail. How cute. And sweats. <laughs> What's new? We have a friend coming over, so we are making a bigger, like, batch. So Matt has, what is this, ground beef? 80-20 ground beef. Okay. This is is about two pounds of it, so I'm doing split it up into eighths, so you got a quarter pound each. Cool, and then I'm gonna do some 93 7 ground turkey Yay. burgers, and then so he is just forming the patties right now, and then we are going to pop them back in the fridge because that is how Shake Shack does it. They said it makes the best crust if you sear them on a cast iron, which we have one of these little skillets, skillet things here. Um, with these little flipper flappy thingies. <laughs> Spatula. Spatula. That's where we're at. And then I'm going, we have these potato rolls and then we also have lettuce just for lettuce wraps. Some Roma tomatoes, white onion, pickles. <laughs> I can't talk, I think right now. If you want cheese, cheese, I'm not gonna do any cheese. This is for the fries, I That's thought. For the fries, but oh, okay. Our friend who is coming over requested that we made the Shake Shack Whole Shake Shack experience. Yeah. Cringle cut. Cheese, cheese fries. fries. So we have frozen fries that we're gonna pop in the air fryer, and then we just got this like block of cheese. I don't know. 
And then we just got some sauerkraut bacon in case people want that on their burgers also. Form them, and then you just salt and pepper at the top. You don't mix any seasoning in the ground beef. Nice. Form them into pucks that are an inch thick because you're gonna smash them into the cast iron when you cook them. Mm. So. Love to see it. See it all come together. So we go along. Okay. Well, cool. Like I said in our last video, we're gonna be doing a truffle or a caramel in each video at the end. But our friends are coming over and we're just gonna do it now before we eat because whatever. So this is the Trader Joe's mystery 12 caramels. The answers are in mystery. The answers are inside, but we're not gonna look. <laughs> so uh, we've been keeping track. The answers. Are all, all in here. <laughs> You'll see that we're having a difficult time with this and even watching the videos along with us. Someone DM'd me on Instagram and said a good idea would be if y'all got the, this with us and then you do the taste test with us. That'd be kind of fun. But you don't have to. That's just an We're not keeping it. No. Okay, so 12, 11, 10. All right, we're on number nine. Because I started from the top and now we're here. Anyway. Okay. Cheers. Hmm. <laughs> It smells like everything else we've had. Damn it! Are they screwing with us? Like they just put the same? It literally tastes like all the other ones. It's hard because there's so much chocolate. Like the, the chocolate on the outside is yeah. the same. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. And there's a little bit of caramel. So we're, half. we're getting half of that. Let's do one more. This is I actually have no idea what that one was. Oh, this smells different. This smells like butterscotch. 10 bucks. Alright? Yeah. Woo! I took us five times, but we got one. Where's like number eight? Butterscotch. I'm gonna put a star by that one because I'm sure of it. It's the only star on the whole thing. Alright, our friends here. This is a lot harder. If you've ever done this taste test before, apparently this was out last year too. Let us know how you did because I'm actually genuinely curious. I'll show you a video of me like building my burger, but otherwise we're gonna spend time with our friend and that's basically it. Whoa. See you. They just, it's a smaller store. There's always a line. Like each of you, you can get in and out. Salt and pepper. Salt and pepper means salt Matt made this little like, charcuterie board of toppings. <laughs> so cute. We got fries, okay. short meat. Ooh. Oh, awesome. Yeah, if you talk, touch Herman. No offense, Herman. Herman. All right. Some of the sauce. Check. I'm gonna do pickles. My favorite. Hello onion. Tomato. That is Shack Burger. Shack Burger. My turkey burger is still going. Oh wait, I gotta show you what you're doing. Okay, so you put the hockey pucks on. All they have is salt and pepper on it. Salt and pepper. What is it? Smash, like a smash burger kind of? Yeah, what is it kind of? Smash it down. Flip, put some cheese on. There you go. You yes, this is. <laughs> Do you want oh. cheese on your burger? Okay, flatten them out and flip. What up? Now like, I'll take them. Alright, you... That one is also a little burnt, this one will be mine. One's got away from me. Yeah. Toast the buns on the black top, on this, right? Alright, there's the final. Matt just took a bite. Dude, you were lying. I'm Out of his. Good. It's amazing. Ooh, you got bacon on yours too? Yeah. <laughs> dang, dang, dang. You wanna be on camera? Look at Megan. It's our friend Clint. He's over. 
Cheers. Cheers. All right, here's the final product. So good. <laughs> so I learned how to do this. Uh, I should talk to Matt. <laughs> Delish. <laughs> <laughs>